I know what y'all are thinking about damn time. No, you probably weren't thinking that, were you? You're probably thinking, JT, that was a weak pun. And maybe you're right. But you might have been thinking, the Hoover Dam. So what, JT? It's a hydroelectric dam. So what? It blocks the Colorado River and creates Lake Mead. So what? And I'm going to show you so what. It's more than what it seems. Let's take a look. This is what? Yeah. Did you guys know that there was creepy angels on top of the Hoover Dam? Sitting on weird black cubes? Yeah, that's strange, right? What are they doing on top of the Hoover Dam? Maybe we should take a closer look at one of them. Yeah. That's weird, right? That's kind of ominous looking. Sinister, even. What is that doing on top of the dam? Maybe we should look at some more pictures for some context, shall we? Yeah, okay, so um, there's a compass with um, astrology, some zodiac signs on it. Uh, maybe the angels are related to the, um, you know, the sign of Taurus, maybe? I don't know, let's keep looking. Maybe it's this. This pyramid pointing out this, this strange word, Thuban. Actually, Thuban comes from an Arabic word that means large serpent or dragon. Huh, you guys making any connections? Large serpents, dragons, angels. Huh. I don't know. Maybe. Let's look at another picture. Hey, check it out. That's pretty cool. An eagle right in front of those angels. And the wings are kind of doing something a little odd. They're kind of going up and there's this light going backwards. You know what that kind of looks like? It kind of looks like a Freemasonry compass and square. Yeah, I think that's what it is. Suddenly, this is making a lot of sense. Let's take a look at one more picture. So we have here is a memorial plaque to commemorate the over 100 men who lost their lives building this dam. Now, I don't know about you guys, but I find this inscription a little bit creepy. They died to make the desert bloom. What's that supposed to mean? Is the implication that they couldn't build the dam without the death? That the desert couldn't bloom without the sacrifices? Are they talking about a hydroelectric dam? Are they talking about Baal in ancient Mesopotamia? I don't know. Maybe the angels and the weird astrology does actually make sense after all.